Leishmaniasis is a neglected disease caused by a microscopic parasite that spreads by the bite of blood-feeding sandflies. Present in 98 countries, Leishmaniasis affects the poorest communities and people in conflict zones with poor medication. Cutaneous Leishmaniasis causes skin lesions, while visceral Leishmaniasis is a deadly form of the disease. The parasite Leishmania is transmitted by infected female sandflies, which release so-called promastigote forms into the skin during a blood meal. Cells of the immune system detect the parasites, and macrophages try to neutralize the promastigotes by engulfing them. However, inside the macrophages' phagolysosomes, the parasite changes into an amastigote form to survive. New genetic tools have made it much easier to study how different Leishmania proteins enable the parasite to survive in the host cell. This project looks at an important group of proteins called membrane transporters. Transporter proteins control the passage of molecules in and out of the cell and between cellular compartments. The parasite needs transporters to take up carbohydrates, amino acids and other nutrients for its survival. It also uses transporters to get rid of toxic substances. These gateways can also be used to administer drugs, such as miltefacin, to kill Leishmania. From studying the genome, we know that Leishmania can make around 300 different transporter proteins. With a new type of molecular scissor, called CRISPR-Cas9, these were cut one by one from the parasite's DNA. This produced a collection of parasite lines that can be used to discover which transporters are important for survival in a macrophage and which ones shuttle drugs in and out of the cell. We hope that this research will discover better and more effective ways of destroying the parasites for good.